life of what it's like for me, a mommy of three, to take my children to extracurricular activities all by myself. So my husband and I have opposite schedules uh, in order for us not to have daycare for our baby. That way one of us is always watching him. So typically I always have to take the kids to their extracurricular activities alone. And it does get a little bit hectic. It does get a little bit crazy and rushed, but um, with the proper scheduling and planning in advance and doing everything in a timely manner, uh, I think I've gotten a little used to it and the hang of things. So I just wanted to show you what it's like. I also did want to mention that this is my kids first time taking swimming lessons and I am a little bit nervous that I'm going to have baby Desi because if something were to happen to the older kids while they're in their classes and I have to jump in and save them I don't know what I'm gonna do with the baby should I like just put them to the side or is that what the lifeguards are there for or their instructors are there for um, I don't know how it's gonna go so wish me luck and I hope everything goes well I hope they learn how to swim I hope they take everything in and I hope mommy is uh, mommy has her anxiety under control and I just let everyone do their job okay so change of plans I noticed that my husband accidentally took the baby's car seat so I had to make some phone calls and now my dad is coming to watch the baby here and I'm gonna go solo to take the kids to the pool so maybe this was meant to be maybe God knew that I was gonna be really really nervous and I had to have both hands available and both eyes available to watch my, my big kids so tomorrow I do have to take all three alone and Sunday so I'll do the day in the life tomorrow okay bye and sorry that I'm panting I was rushing around trying to figure out where the car seat was and who was gonna come watch Desi baby so yeah bye. happy Saturday everyone change of plans yet again um, my husband failed to tell me that he changed his schedule with his co-worker today So therefore I don't have to take the kids to swimming classes by myself. He's gonna take them. Yay! Are you excited about that? Yeah, because then he gets to see us swimming yesterday Mommy got us to see us swimming. Yep, so today I'm gonna stay home with Desi baby. I'm gonna shower when he naps. I'm gonna clean our dirty sink and our dirty stove and it's gonna be a productive saturday right mm -hmm. all right see you guys tomorrow bye. bye so today i have to take the kids to swimming class by myself and i'm actually not in the best of moods desi woke up at four in the morning and went back to sleep around 6 30 in the morning and it's a little early right now my head is throbbing i don't feel like i got any sleep nyla noah uh, woke me up as soon as we, Desi and I, fell back to sleep, and I just feel like crap. So I'm gonna take my vitamins and hopefully I'll feel better. I know that I look terrible. I feel terrible. I'm gonna go looking like this to swimming class. I don't care. It is what it is. That's life. That's my life. That's mommy life. All right, so we're in the car. I had my vitamins. I sprayed myself with my lavender chamomile facial spray. I told myself today is going to be a good day. Today is going to be a good day. And guess what? Today is going to be a good day. Yes, buddy? Um, when are we going to get there? We're going to get there in about 10 minutes. So... Every time I go out with the three kids by myself and I need both hands available, I use my Moby Wrap. It's a lifesaver. I carry the baby in my wrap and I have my hands available to do whatever it is that I have to do. But I always put on my Moby Wrap before I leave home because it does take me a while. Even though I've used it for years and years and years, I always still need a mirror and it takes, my, it takes time for me to do it uh, slowly because if I wait to do it when I arrive to the place, I get anxiety and I give up, I get frustrated, I start sweating, and I don't wanna have to do that. And I told you guys that I was not gonna wear makeup and I am not wearing makeup. I told you I was gonna wear my hair in a bun and I am, I kinda just sprayed down the frizzies so I can look, so I can look a little bit presentable, but um, you guys will notice that I wear my hair in a bun 95% of the time. And by the way, it's already like 90 degrees outside. It's only 10 in the morning and I put shorts on. I did notice that I haven't shaved my legs, but I was not about to wear pants. Long leg hair, don't care. Long
long legged dog here. All right, guys, ready to go? Okay, so we've arrived. Desi's in his wrap. The kids are ready to go uh, swimming. Say hi, guys. Hi. Oh yeah guys, if you're new to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and if you like the video, give it a like. Um, so I did want to mention that I do leave my house at least 12 minutes early every time, no matter where I have to be because, uh, you know, I hate being late and anything can happen. I need the extra minutes to... Yeah, Nyla said I just said a very strong word, which is the H-A-T-E word. And she's very right. <laughs> so, oh look, Desi actually fell yesterday and has his first scrape. So he has a little boo-boo. All right guys, let's go to swim class. Ready? So the kids are done with their class. How was it guys? Good, it was so much fun. And we went under the water and we caught rings. One of them I was swimming underwater the whole time. And one of them all by herself without floating. Yay, that and Desi true. did great. I just got him out of the raft. He's like, I'm free. I'm free. All right, bye guys. I'm glad you had a good Sunday. Yay! Bye! Bye!